Well, hello everyone. Just want to do a quick intro uh, for these tours you guys are about to go on. I'm just getting over a cold, so forgive me if I cough or <clears throat> blow my nose or whatever. Uh, we've been focusing on advanced manufacturing today, and we know an important part of teaching STEM is connecting the things we teach with careers. And our local industry is a great example of STEM careers in action. The three locations you will visit today are really going to give you an idea of how we can apply some of the things we're teaching our students into real world situations. Um, SBI, Knopf, Optest, they are all committed to modern manufacturing methods and being green. Um, it's amazing that a manufacturer uh, would really focus on on that but it's you know they realize that it's important to us but it's also important to them because when they look at their future they want to know that they have a place and especially with SPI for example it's easy to see that without more trees right how are they gonna log and <clears throat> they might not go over this in the tour but SPI owns all their own land and they have a replanting system that is going to enable them to have enough trees for forever into the future. So it's really neat that um, both uh, SP, well, all three, Knopf, SPI, and Optest are focused on being environmentally conscious. We're going to see some really cool automation in action. We're going to have an opportunity to see how uh, both parts and entire pieces of machinery can be designed uh, in 3D and, and then manufactured. Uh, we're going to see different uh, maybe solutions for manufacturing, both 3D printer, CNC, and you know more labor intensive uh, and, and I guess um, traditional skilled uh, machining. And we're, we're really going to see what our students can do with some of the skills we learn. Now, it's true that when we look at our students' future, many of the jobs that they will have aren't even invented yet. But we can see with a progression of where these companies have been uh, in the last few years and where they're going, uh, that they are committed to increasing their efficiency and productivity and whenever those that new technology comes out that uh, you know that they need to, to change to, they will, and, and there will be a place for our students uh, in advanced manufacturing in the future. I'm a big fan of all of these facilities. I've personally been on the tour of all three of them, and I think you're gonna you're gonna be amazed uh, to see how Knopf uh, makes uh, <clears throat> insulation from recycled glass. To see how fast Optest can test LEDs and other electronics coming off of the production line, and and where they're going with that, all the way into full service manufacturing. To see how efficient. Sierra Pacific can be with getting everything they need out of their logs and then using the waste to generate electricity. It's going to be it's going to be really amazing. Hopefully, you can write down some some things as you're uh, taking the tour. Some things you know you'll want to share with your students in the classroom. Also, some questions you're going to want to ask uh, maybe towards the end of the tour, and some of the things you want to bring back to the group because. Everyone's only going to be able to go on one tour each, and so the only way we're going to really find out about what happened at the other places is if we share. So, so make sure you do that. I know you're going to have a great time. I know it's going to be an amazing experience, and I hopefully you will, you know, be able to ignite that passion for for advanced manufacturing, uh, and especially about the manufacturing that's going on in our area. Uh, our our goal as a local community is to get more large manufacturers here. Uh, so that we can increase uh, employment and also so that we can, I guess, jumpstart that entrepreneurial spirit and start other small companies that will support uh, the manufacturing of these large ones. So thanks again. Have a great time. And I can't wait to hear uh, about the tours when you get back. Thanks.